Oh hello, welcome back. Let's create this crawling text effects on a ribbon in After Effects. This is a part of a kinetic typography that you can use for your motion graphics. And let's start making the ribbon. Click on this rectangle tool and then you drag it just like so. Afterwards you right click on the shape layer and then you head over to transform and then you click here. And then afterwards right click on the shape layer again and then click here. Just like so. Afterwards, um, you create the text. Type anything, for example, um, subscribe to tongue tips. That's an example. Change the thickness of the font if you want. Afterwards, um, you want to you want the text to uh, move, right? So uh, put it to the right side, and then afterwards, uh, you set a keyframe by clicking on the stopwatch icon. Let's say if you want the text to stop moving at um, 10, 10 and a half seconds, you drag it to the left. Make sure that the vertical position stays at um, 566. Afterwards, you can duplicate the text by holding the control and the C keys and then paste it by holding the control and the V keys and then put each text layer to a much different timestamp. Afterwards, then rename the composition as crawling white ribbon just like this afterwards you copy it again and then you paste it and then you head over here and then um no actually delete this and then you drag the first one and then you head over to effects color correction no 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 channel and then invert so that the color changes position just like so now let's create the um the duplications now let's duplicate the ribbon. Click on the comp one and then afterwards you drag it just like so. You can duplicate it as many times as you want. You can do some tweaks with the rotation as well so that it looks like this pretty much. Once you're done you can also um, pre-compose everything by selecting them all and then right clicking on the grouped objects and then you click on pre-compose and then you click on OK. Afterwards you can add some um, lens effects by typing lens just like this. Under distort, afterwards you just um, increase the size so that it looks like this. Uh, set the convergence to let's say this. You can do some tweaks with the lens effect so that the composition looks concave or curved inwards and then and then you're done with the crawling text effects on the ribbon. That's how you make it. Thanks for watching. Do drop like if you enjoyed the video. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. But for me, it's a good day. Ciao.